This is a playthrough of Monster Flux. All right, so we got the base eights. I think it's three cards. Been a long time. Who wants to go first? Uh, you can. I can, okay. For a reminder. Okay, that's fun, that's fun. Okay, so I'm going to, so our game is going to start with Howl at the Moon. Whoever has the Wolfman and the Moon card wins the game. two. Okay. So set my hand aside, draw three cards, play two of them, and then discard the last card. And pick up my hand and continue with my turn. something other than a new rule or a like a dungeon like he did do we like for example like a keeper can we play those or yeah they just go right in front of you oh okay and you play okay. one at a time well, yeah you just you play one card you draw one card okay i've got a werewolf hunting and a lunar cyclops okay so okay so you're playing those okay so that goes away so you're doing in this order so you're changing this goal to the oh, werewolf okay. hunting, and then you're changing the goal again to the lunar cyclops. Oh. So whoever has the one-eyed, uh, the, the, uh, the fuzzy monster in the moon wins. Because we don't have the other new rule out that allows you to play two of those out yet. I thought they were like things that I was going to have. No, no, the goal cards, are just that's the overall goal. Okay. I thought they were good. But see, the thing about it is, say, if you had the fuzzy monster and the moon out, and then you actually, and, you know, say if Mary had that, and then you played this, then she would auto win. Mm. Mm. So, it varies. Okay. But the green cards, you can play a keeper in front of you with no problem. They do. There's no limit on keepers you can have in play right now. But I can play more than only oh, one a turn, or? Play one card. Draw one What's card. Your drink? One There's a tail by you. That's yeah, that's it. That's the only. That's unless you have a. a uh, you want to change a rule? Like I'm going to change a rule. Okay. Okay. New rule. Hand, hand limit, limit of two, two, so you can't have more than two oh, cards in your hand. Oh, that's nifty. Uh, draw your card. And I do it at the end of. Yes. And now oh, because I thought you... it was draw and then play. Huh. Yeah, draw one then play one. Okay, then draw one. Okay. So okay. That's fine. So. That's fine, but you still have to dump a card. Yes, I know. Because whenever a rule goes into effect, it automatically goes into effect. So if it says, like, draw five... Yeah, it's at the end of my turn, where everybody else is before their turn. Right, but what I'm saying, though, is if you play, a, like, a draw card, like, say, I'm going to play draw five, mm -hmm. and you had you only drew one that turn, now you have to draw the other four cards. Oh. Mm -hmm. So it's automatic. Yeah. So... Okay. So, so at the beginning of your turn, you have to discard one, right? First, because that's what it says here. Oh. Down to two, and then play your turn. You can only have two cards in your hand. Discard extra cards immediately during your turn. This rule does not apply to you. Discard at the end of your turn. Ew. So. End yeah. of turn. Okay. So end of turn, you have to draw. You have to discard down to two. So I think. So I'm... you draw first. You draw a card. Oh yeah, that's right. I thought I was the one that didn't affect you, until the end of turn. But you played your card. 
That was your card that you yeah, played. Yeah, I know. So you had to discard down to two. Well, at the after end of your drawing, turn. yeah. Yeah, at the end of your turn. Yeah. Yeah. But this is at the beginning of their turn you have to do that, right? It says on the card, during your turn, this rule does not apply to you. Discard at the that's, end of your turn. That's this one. My yeah, turn. but this applies to everybody. I know. So, so at the end of your turn, you had to dump down to two. Yeah, so end that. of my turn, I guess it doesn't yep. So there's no problems then. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. So I thought it was the uh, other way around. I'm gonna play a keeper. Okay. Teenage detectives. Teenage detectives. Yep. You Scooby doing a Scooby doing us? I am. I am totally gonna do a Scooby Doo right over here. Um. <clears throat> okay. I don't you draw a card for that? Huh? After you played. No. Because I drew one, play one, and now I have to okay. discard. Okay. So I'm going to discard this rule. I don't want it. And now I have two cards. Uh, we're going to play the Mad Scientist, and I'm going to discard that old man person in his gorilla suit. That's no favorite. Okay. okay. I'm still lost in this game. So. You're putting too much thought into it. Apparently. Play what do keepers do in anyway? laboratory? They can do different things. These are both keepers. So if you have both of them, you would win automatically. Okay. And I'm uh, good. Go ahead. See how, like, keeper do you have? Laboratory. See how this one? Teenage detectives. If you had, if she had the teenage detectives in Bigfoot, she'd automatically win. Yeah. Oh. Okay. So draw first. Yeah. You're gonna get dogs in your video. Sorry. It's fine. Surprisingly, Charles has been in a couple of mine, so. Oh, angry mob of villagers. <coughs> All right, my turn. What's yep. your angry mob of villagers do? Uh, if I have this at the big, uh, during my turn, I, you may move it to another player and discard one of their keepers. No. Oh, that's not nice. That's not nice at all. <laughs> so, yeah. Ooh, I'm going to. That wasn't played, okay. I'm going to put down Bigfoot. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she did. She, <laughs> she would have won. Yeah, no. <laughs> but, but. Uh, no. Aww. But I want to win. Find a card that lets you pull stuff from the okay. New rule open the door for a free action once during your turn. If a player has the spooky door on the table, you can immediately draw and play a card. Oh, well, that's, that's not door. in the door, that's not but in the play. The spooky door is in discard, that's fine, but the, the rule is in play. Yeah, okay. You better get your spooky door back. You mean my spooky door? Oh, your spooky door. Yeah, I'm the one who discarded it. I got the wolf man. Um, let's play an action. The Monster Mash. Give me all your keepers. What's it do? I, uh, take all the keepers, shuffle them up, and deal them around. Oh. And then... Oh. I don't think I like that one. Hi. I'm glad you're getting used to me. Man. I got the mob and the teenage. And detectives. I got the Bigfoot. <laughs> I got my laboratory back. <laughs> okay. Thank you, your turn. Okay. Yeah, I thought that one was fun. <laughs> Oh, 
oh, that would that would really just not be fun for me. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna play Frankie Fra Frankenstein, the Franken monster. The monster. All right, uh, let's see here. I'm gonna play a fuzzy monster. There. Halfway. I just need the moon. The moon. Uh, I got a lab assistant from my lab. Right. Oh, wait. No. No, I'm just letting you read it. Oh, you have this on the map. <laughs> but I have the lab. What are you guys gonna do without the lab? Do I then do I draw? Dark art, yeah. Because okay. that doesn't count as your. Oh, it might my play. It just happens. yeah, that just it happens. Ah, uh, your big your monster. Take your choice of any keeper displayed on the table and put it in the discard pile. You're making me discard my monster. Yes. That's wow. Not, that's mean. It's it's part of the game. That's mean. My turn? Yeah. Okay. Huh. Don't think I want you having this. I don't think I want any of you having this. Let's simplify. Discard your choice of up to half rounded rounded up of the new rule cards in play. I don't really like this two, this one right here. Okay. I would like to have a little more than two hand, cards in my hand, please. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah, I'm getting rid of that. Okay. Okay. Nope, nope, nope. Cool. Well, it's still only draw one, though, right? Yeah. Yeah. So. But at later, we can you heck, can throw draw more if you have one. But now we can have more than two cards in our hand. And then you get the if, yes. That part is up to you. That just looks, looks cute. Yes. Just cute. <laughs> just, she's just like chilling on the couch. Uh, this creature's alive. If there's any monster keepers cards in, in the discard pile, choose one and place it in front of you. <laughs> Can actions be played at any time? Uh, no. no. That has to be, turn. unless it's a rule. Okay, I can't remember. Yeah, we're going to take the... Fuzzy monster. <laughs> hey, I get. I may not know much about the game yet, but I do get. I handle on games pretty easy. You're gonna make me play this, Doug. You're really gonna make me play this. Yes. Okay. Sometimes you have to hurt yourself to hurt others. Fine. Okay, um, I'm going to play Everybody Gets One, so I'm going to draw four cards and decide who gets what. Each, we each get one of these, and I get to decide who gets what. Ah, nifty. Okay, now that I'm getting a hang, kind of getting an understanding how it is that the rules change. Yeah, it's not, it, the rules are not that complicated, it's just, you gotta figure out, once you've played a few rounds. Well, so far it's like, okay, just play, play, play. Okay. And so... screw somebody over. <laughs> it's like Munchkin, in that, in that sense. Mm -hmm. Who's over there? Who? Hmm. Yeah, and the upside is this version doesn't have any creepers, so you don't have to deal with any of that. What's that? Creepers are bad cards. Uh -huh. Okay, now I'm done. Oh. Thank you, honey. You're welcome. Okay, so draw. Hmm. <clears throat> I'm gonna 
change the goal. Ooh, it's the new goal. Whoever has the tombstone and either the ghost or skeleton, so rest in peace. Hi. My turn? Mm-hmm. I'm going to destroy all the monsters, your keep fuzzy monsters included. Anything with an eyeball. That's mean. Hey, oh, yeah. I don't have an eyeball. Nope, you don't. Nope. It, like I said, it hurts me more than it hurts him. Well, it really didn't matter anymore because he didn't need the, the fuzzy monsters. Yeah, let's change this goal to uh, bat transformation. Whoever has the vampire and the bats wins. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> um. All right. Um, I guess we're going to storm the castle. Well, that kind of helps Doug. Uh, the mob of villagers and the castle. Yeah. Okay. A cauldron? Yep. <laughs> I'm gonna play the moon. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> uh, we'll change this to Dracula's castle. So, wolf and the castle? The castle and a vampire. You had half oh. of that first. I had to play something. Oh. <laughs> and I don't want to play the rest of these. Oh. A couple in my hand, I'm like, maybe. Yeah, a couple of these I don't want to play. Oh, wow. Ew. Okay. <laughs> uh oh. I'm going to do play three. Oh, jeez. So you can play up to three cards. Yes, but now Steven has to play another two cards. Okay, perfect. Uh-oh. All right, uh, I'm going to take... Does that count as a hand? Okay, here's a uh, new rule bon monster bonus. So if you've got an eyeball creature, you get to do whatever that is. I think it's draw an extra card or something. Oh, darn. Draw and play an extra card per turn if you at least have one monster keeper on the table in front of you. And... Um, Does this count as a hand limit? No. No, okay. My last one... That's just playing cards. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You don't have to play all three. You do? Mm, well, okay. that sucks. I'm going to do a zap a card and... Put this one in my hand. Okay. Okay. <laughs> that is. Okay. Okay. So it's back to playing. Draw play. Draw one. Play one. Yes. And I'm going to play a new rule. Draw two. I get to draw one more, right? Yep. No, it's draw two, play as many as you want. No, it's no, draw two, draw two, play, draw one. two play one. Because he bounced his thing. Mm. Do I have to discard? There's no discard. Okay. Nope. 
and I'm good. Unless, it, unless there's a rule saying you can. Yeah. There's no hand limit either. Well, that's what I mean by it. Yeah, I got rid of that because I did not like that rule. <laughs> yeah, I did have it minus one. Oh, you know what? I'm going to replace that too with a five. Draw five. Five? Nice. So yeah, it was two, right? You drew? So you get three more. You get three more. Yep. I'm done. I played my card. <laughs> One, <laughs> two, three, four, five. <laughs> All right, I'm going to change the rule <laughs> to mob of teenagers, I win. <laughs> you have the, oh, wow. That's it, just the mob of teenagers? Yeah. He needs the mob he of has the mob, mob and, and, and the, the teenage teenagers. detectives. Oh. Oh. And I actually had... Cat Dracula in his <laughs> castle. Um, I had a rules reset to go back to the basic rules I was going to use because I wanted to get five for this round turn and then come back. Um, play all but one. Oh. <laughs> well, no, if he hadn't been able to play that one with playing the three cards again, I would have won also. I got close because... a couple of times. That's fine. I was trying to figure out how to steal both of your guys' keepers. So I was like, hmm. <laughs> Which one, the cauldron? No, the the lab and the mad scientist. Oh. Uh, so. This one would have a fuzzy alien and door. I was waiting for the, uh, doing the same thing he did, but it was, uh, uh, if I needed the tombstone. That's okay, that was fun. Yep. Different, different, different. Kind of an easy game, once, yeah. you, once you get the hang of it. Mm. Easy game. And this has been a playthrough of Monster Flux. Right.